us as well. I like the way he said that. Greg has to say something. Um, so I think mostly what I have to say is just a thank you to a ton of people. Uh, we, um, you know, we started this out uh, with kind of a, a general idea that we wanted to do something in AI and healthcare. Uh, it's a rich space, um, and we know that. Uh, actually, I think this is the wrong uh, deck. I'm sorry. It's a rich space, and we know that we we had a lot to explore, and I think we we covered a lot today. Um, what I would like to do now is just simply um, make sure that we thank a set of people. So I'm just going to use this. Uh, sorry, which uh, so. Actually, maybe while Catherine's setting me up, so I make sure I don't forget anybody, I'll, I'll say the one thing that I was thinking about, you know, we started out the day and, and the title was, was Bench to Bedside, which is uh, um, an engineer's natural way of thinking about things. Uh, Dan Ford, in his opening remarks, um, talked about going from the bedside to the bench, which I think makes a ton of sense because obviously we really want to make sure that we are uh, focusing on problems that are relevant. But I, I think the one thing that I would take away from the, the day is, uh, in fact, uh, I think we have to stop thinking about benches and bedsides. I think what we need to be thinking about is just finding problems that are relevant, finding the teams that can work together. And I think what we've seen is the incredible progress we've already made uh, in uh, really what's a relatively short time uh, you know, that the most recent methods in, in AI have uh, been uh, applied in healthcare. Um, so with that, I, I want to just, uh, again, do a few thanks. First, I want to thank all of our speakers and participants. Uh, we had several people who traveled from far away to come and be here with us today. So uh, particularly uh, a round of applause for them. And then I want to highlight our organizing committee, many of whom you've seen today. Uh, and, and what I'd like to also highlight, I think, again, in the spirit of the day, it's a, a highly collaborative effort between uh, faculty and engineering, uh, faculty from the School of Medicine. Particularly, I want to give a shout out to the Radiology and AI Lab, which played a, a strong role in organizing this, and also Phil Fan from the Kerry School of Business. So I think it really institute, it really uh, shows the, the power of Hopkins and the breadth of the institution that we can come together and do this. So, so everybody who is on the organizing team, again, I'd like to just extend a, a great thank you. And lastly, um, these are the most important people. Uh, you came in this morning and there was breakfast and there were name tags and there were programs that were printed and people knew where to go and then you got lunch and you got breaks. And by the way, there is uh, refreshments waiting uh, afterwards out there. And that's really uh, the, the hard work of these people. I particularly want to give a shout out to Catherine Grimm. Catherine has really done, I would say, uh, the lion's share of the organization of the symposium. She's handled all of the PR, she's handled the emails, she's handled your registration. Pretty much every slide you saw is something that Catherine did. So Catherine, could you take a quick bow? And I also want to call out Vess Clark, Tracy Marshall, uh, Laura Graham, and Aria Smith. I see Aria standing right there. Um, they've also just been a super team to work with. You know, I came in at 7.45 this morning and things were ready to go. And I'll, I'll point out it's 7.45 Monday morning, so you know what they were doing this weekend. So, guys, thanks so much. This has really been great. Awesome. I'm going to turn you loose. Uh, we have outside uh, some food. We have some drink. This is your chance to talk over the day, network a little bit, uh, enjoy one on us, uh, and then I hope that you go home you, and you have something from today that, that really has uh, made uh, something different. Thank you. <laughs>